Assalamu alaikum. My name is Hamza Dabian from Princess Sumaya University for Technology. I would like to present our available power gain circles and constant noise figure circles presentation for microwave class. My partner, Hamad Hussain. Hello everybody. Today we are going to talk about an example of available power gain circles and constant noise figure circles. The example is the scattering and noise parameters of a BGT measured at a price point for low noise operation are S11 equal 0.552 with angle 169 degree, S12 equal 0.049 with angle 23 degree, S21 equal 1.681 with angle 26 degree, S22 equal 0.839 with angle minus 67 degree. F minimum equal 2.5 dB. Gamma out equal 0.475 with angle 166 degree. Rn equal 3.5 ohm. Given that VCE equal 10 volt, IC equal 4 milliampere at frequency equal 4 gigahertz. The question is, design a microwave transistor amplifier to have a minimum noise figure. We open the microwave calculator to write the S parameters on the microwave calculator. To find the available power gain circles, we click on the available power gain circles button. Then we press on the available power gain button to find the maximum available power gain to draw circles for each values. For example, if we choose this values for 10.7 dB of available gain, it gives this values of radius equal 0 and magnitude equal 0.943, where the phase is constant for all values of available power gain. So we can choose the next values of available power gain, which gives us the magnitude and radius and so on. So we draw this table that gives us the values of radius and magnitude for all values of available gains. Now we open GitHub program. We import Smith chart PDF. Make zoom. Go to table. We draw a line with angle minus 154 degree. We put a point at minus 154 degree. Use a ruler to draw the line. From the table, the distance for maximum available power gain, 14.7 dB, is 0 0.94 and radius is 0. Use a compass and open 0 0.94 from a third scale. Then we set this point on the line. In this case, the available power gain will appear as a point because the radius is zero. Now the second available power gain is 13.7 dB. It has a distance 0.85 and radius 0.14. Open compass by the distance and put point 
on the line. Then open compass one again by a value of radius and draw the circle. This circle for 13.7 dB. Next step. We go to the table and take a next magnitude and radius for the next available power gain, then draw the circle and so on. Again, we open the microwave calculator to find the noise figure circles. Then, we put the values for the magnitude, phase, F minimum, and our input, which was given in the example. 
Then, we choose the values for noise figure which is greater than or equal the minimum noise figure value. Then, we press on the noise figure circle button to find the radius and magnitude where the phase is constant for all values of noise figure. Then we repeat the same steps to find the values for noise figure circles. For example, we choose 2.6 dB noise figure, 2.8 noise dB noise figure, and 3 dB noise figure. This table show the value for the magnitude and radius for all values of noise figure where the angle is constant for all values of noise figure which is equal to 166 degree now to draw the noise figure circle we must follow the, these steps First, we determine the phase value on the Smith chart, then click on the ruler to draw a line. Then, from the table, we choose the magnitude, which is equal to 0.475, and open the compass 0.475 on the reflection coefficient scale. Then, determine the point on the line. To draw the first circle, which is radius equal to 0. To draw the next circle, we must follow the same steps as shown on the screen. We choose the next magnitude which is equal to 0.455 and open the compass 0.455 on the reflection coefficient scale to draw a point on the line. As shown on the screen, we draw a point on the line. Then, we open the compass the value of the radius which is equal to 0.184 to draw the circle from the magnitude point we selected. Now, this circle represents 2.6 dB noise figure. To draw the next circle, we open the table and select the value for the magnitude and radius to the next circle. Then, open the compass 0.44 on the reflection coefficient scale to determine the point on the line.
Finally, thank you for listening.